girl Kim and I am back with another video. Today's video we are doing Big Girl Thursday. It's a segment on my channel that I haven't done in a while but I promise for 2020 I will be back with the Big Girl Thursday videos. And Happy New Year! I hope you guys have your goals and whatever you guys want to accomplish this year I wish you guys the best of luck. In today's video I will be giving you fashion tips that I feel like every curvy girl needs okay so on my channel we don't use the word fat we use thick we use curvy we use voluptuous we use thickums anything but the word fat goes okay so if you are a little big and you just want to know how to dress better little tips and tricks that are going to help your fashion or just upgrade your swag this is the channel for you so don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like comment and of course share all my videos and let's get straight into the video so the first tip that I am going to give you is if you want to wear crop tops match your crop tops to high-waisted things it could be a high-waisted skirt it could be a high-waisted jean I prefer jeans because jeans are going to suck you in and they're going to give you more shape so I like crop tops with jeans okay like these jeans are from Fashion Nova and this top is from African Mall okay and Fashion Nova has the best jeans like for big girls so if you want the plug on that or you want me to do a video or a haul for Fashion Nova jeans holler at me in the comment section but when you rock high-waisted jeans with a crop top it cinches in your waist you still look cute you still look trendy you know what I mean you can still rock this you know you can go outside you know nothing is really showing that bad there's nothing you know so pair your crop tops with high-waisted jeans or high-waisted skirts that is tip number one all right now to get into tip number two tip number two if you still want to rock like crop tops and jeans or crop tops and skirts or a little outfit that's like too risky and you feel like you're not comfortable or you feel like you're showing too much what you need is a kimono right so a kimono is like a little duster that you throw over your outfit this right here I got from handbags and perfumes it is an Instagram boutique I'll put the link in the description below but the minute you just throw this on you just upgraded your outfit already the pics are gonna be fly because you've got movement you know what I mean but look what you just added coverage you're still rocking your crop top and your jeans or your crop top and your mini skirt or you're rocking a really really short skirt and you just need this little bit of you know coverage or you're wearing a bodycon dress and you feel a little fluffy but you still want to wear it throw a kimono on you know what I mean it's still sexy it's still stylish you're still wearing what you want you know so kimonos now this works this is cute okay but if you feel like no but now my outfit is a little bit too covered up you're bringing me to tip number three so tip number three shape include share material share tops share skirts share kimonos cover-ups whatever okay and no, this is not just for the beach. Most people will be like, isn't that a cover up for the beach? No, it's about how you style it, okay? Now, if you throw this on, still see through. You still have a little bit of coverage. You know what I mean? You still have coverage. It's still stylish you've got movement you're still wearing your crop top same thing as the previous kimono but this is a little see-through do you see you can apply this technique with sheer t-shirts i think i just said that sheer skirts i like sheer skirts the ones that come with little booties 
booty shorts and you wear it through I like those so find ways to incorporate sheer material and that will actually up your sexy you know what I mean girl so the fourth fashion tip that I have for you guys is if you're going to reveal something downstairs cover up upstairs if you're going to the birds are gonna drive me crazy if you're going to obviously expose something at the top cover up at the bottom as a curvy girl you have to be aware that we're working with a whole lot more okay and for some odd reason I don't know but it's more shocking or it's got that shock value when um, a curvy girl is a little more revealing for example the Lizzo situation we all know Lizzo is curvy she's big she's beautiful she's sexy but the world damn near came to a stop because the girl shared her booty how many times have we seen Rihanna's booty Beyonce's booty like it's not that serious but because it's Lizzo the impact was massive do you see what I mean so sometimes to just combat that I suggest if you are going to reveal something at the top cover up at the bottom so this is one of my favorite mini skirts this mini skirt is from Fashion Nova the link will be in the description below I mean this is a long sleeve black top I can pair this with black with white whatever color pretty much or neutral i don't like to do a lot of colors so if i do color it's normally surrounded by neutrals you could do gray with this you know whatever but because it's so short it's so figure hugging can y'all see it is so figure hugging it is super short therefore most of the times when i wear this i will be covered so i'll be wearing like a long sleeve a high neck just something to tone down the whole entire look you get what i mean and it works because you still do sexy but you're not doing you know coarse traffic type of vibes so that would be my next tip and also and also my favorite thing about the skirt is the fact that it hides your belly but don't worry, I'm going to come up with another video of little things that hide the belly. So stay tuned for that video. An example of that would be this. So, yeah. girl who said big girls can't slay. Where? <laughs> so, I'm digging this. This is cute. So, yeah, if you expose at the bottom, cover up at the top. Real, real simple. <clears throat> So the last of my fashion tip is a maxi dress. This maxi dress is flowy. I got it from Handbergs and Perfumes. Of course, it's an Instagram boutique like I said and the link will be in the description below. This is a cute dress. This is flowy. It goes down all the way. So for my tall girls, don't worry. It is super, super long. It's open hair. It's it's a very light material. You can breathe in it. And it's an essential for curvy girls because this is what you're going to wear when you feel like crap. I think every curvy girl can relate to waking up in the morning. You're trying to put this on. You don't feel comfortable. You feel like it's not, you know, feel like you put on weight. Nothing is fitting. A maxi dress is going to be your saving glory okay a maxi dress is actually essential for a couple other reasons but for this video a maxi dress I would suggest it for the days where you don't know what to wear where you don't know how you feeling nothing is fitting a maxi dress is always a must now I prefer maxi dresses with slits one because it takes amazing pictures and two because you still want to show a little bit of body a maxi dress has a way of covering up too much you know what I mean and then you don't feel sexy so a slit always ensures you know a little bit of leg a little bit of you know and what I like is a deep V 
exposes a little bit of chest a little bit of arm you know what i mean because you are covered everywhere else and you don't want to look swallowed by the material so get maxi dresses that have slits that are a bit deep V, that are that have cut out. I've seen maxi dresses that have cut out at the back. You can rock that type of you know vibe where it's still sexy but you don't feel overly exposed and you don't have to wear shapewear with this dress. Hey, it's hot. I don't always want to wear shapewear. But that's the end of our video. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel. I really, really appreciate you guys watching this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And of course, if you have any questions for your girl, holla at me in the comment section. I want to hear all your curvy girl issues and I'm going to do my best to solve them for you. And even if you have any fashion questions, makeup, whatever girl, holla at me in the comment section and I'm always going to reply.